Ladies and gentlemen, there are a lot of skills necessary for this job. Uh, I got to be able to write comedy, interview celebrities, bench press my own weight. But <laughs> perhaps the most important thing is spotting trends, pointing out things you haven't noticed yet, and make sure everyone's aware of them. After all, I'm the guy who made it cool to say, "You bet your olives." <laughs> John, has that one cut on yet? You bet your olives. <laughs> See, <laughs> kind of a trendsetter. And right now, there's a trend that seemingly everyone is getting into. Becoming a Republican presidential candidate. <laughs> also, also vaping. <laughs> E-cigarettes, the smokeless dragon. E-cigarettes heat nicotine-infused liquid into inhalable steam, which gives a quick buzz and gets all the wrinkles out of your lungs. <laughs> and vaping has caught fire, with recent polls showing an estimated 10% of U.S. adults now vape. And just last year, global sales of vapor devices broke six billion dollars. Six billion dollars is more money than all the Transformer movies combined. <laughs> By the way, the long-term health risk of watching all the Transformer movies have not been determined. <laughs> Best of all, vaping can make you feel young, because e-cigarette makers are allowed to advertise to anyone on TV, which has led to ads like this one for Juul Vapor. Yeah, yeah, something about inhaling poison steam just makes me want to dance in a way that doesn't require much lung strength. <laughs> and it's not just ads featuring hip young triangles that appeal to the youths. <laughs> So do vape flavors like cotton candy, gummy bear, and Skittles. Yes, Skittle vape, huff the rainbow. <laughs> and best of all, best of all, folks, there is no reason to worry about vaping because e-cigarettes are so new that their long-term effects are still unknown. See, effects unknown could be cancer, could be laser vision. <laughs> Now, personally, I've never vaped. Alcohol has always been my preferred method of getting a headache and throwing up. <laughs> but I, I think I'm starting to understand the appeal of these smokeless cigarettes. They'd be great while you're snorting a cup of coffee or right after you have sex with a humidifier. <laughs> Still, as I promise you, I will not be vaping on this show. I am a trusted broadcaster and a role model, and I refuse to manipulate young people just to please corporate interests. However, if you don't buy my sponsors' products, they will literally cancel me. Please, I'm begging you.